hello you are welcome here let's solve this system of equation and uh, finding the value of x and y and uh, let's label this as equation one and this as equation two from equation two we can write six x y and separate it as three x times two y which is equals to five and uh, in the next step, let's use a letter now to represent 3x. Let a be equals to 3x and b be equals to 2y. Then we can write equation, the two equations given again now in terms of a and b. And the equation 1 become a plus b equals to 6. And equation 2 will become a multiplied by b, that's ab, equals to 5. Then from the first equation here, we make b the subject. And then from here, we can say from here, b will now be equals to 6 minus a. When we take a to that side, so we have that. Then, in the next step, we write this equation now and substitute b equals to 6 minus a. Then we have a multiplied by 6 minus a. Then is equals to 5. Then let's open this bracket and solve from here. This gives us 6a. Then minus a squared equals to 5. Then we rearrange and we bring 5 to this side. So we have minus a squared plus 6a equals to 5 from here. Then in the next step, we multiply through by minus and then we remove this minus here. So this becomes a squared minus 6a. So we have taken this one here before. It has become minus 5, which is equal to 0. Then when we multiply through by minus, it becomes plus 5, which is equal to 0. Then from here, we can factorize this. So we have a squared minus a minus 5a will be equal to minus 6a. Also, when we multiply, it will be equal to plus 5. Then plus 5, which is equal to 0. From these two, what is common is a. We have a into bracket a minus 1 left here. The minus 5 comma here into bracket a minus 1 also equals to 0. Then we have a minus 1 comma here. Then we are left with a minus 5 which is equals to 0. Then either of this could be 0. So we have two cases. We have a minus 1 is equals to 0. Or we have a minus 5 equals to 0. So from here, a is equals to 1. And from here, a is equals to 5. Then, equation 2, which is 3x times 2y equals to 5. And uh, since we have represented 3x as a, and our a is equals to 1, so we can say 1 times 2y is equals to 5 now. This is t2y equals to 5. Then we divide both sides by 2. Then y here will be equals to 5 over 2. And from this same equation, from here, we can also substitute the value of y from there. Then we have 3x multiplied by 2 into bracket y. Now that's 5 over 2 equals to 5. Then from here, 2, we cancel 2. And also we divide both sides by 5. And 3x will now be equals to 1. Then from here, we have x to be equals to 1 over 3. Then on this side, that means we have x common y will give us 1 over 3 comma 5 over 2 from there. Then on the other side, we have a to be equals to 5. Then the same thing here, we use this, since a now is represented as 3x, so we can say 5 here now, times 2y 
is now equals to 5. Also divide both sides by 5. We have 2y equals to 1 from here. And the y will be equals to 1 over 2. That's half. Then also from the same equation, we substitute y equals to half. Then we have 3x. Now we give up times 3x times 2 into bracket half, which is equals to 5. Of course, this cancel out. And we have 3x equals to 5 left. Divide both sides by 3. Here we have x equals to 5 over 3. And uh, on this side, we have our x comma y. Here it gives us x is 5 over 3. Then y is half from here. So in this particular question given, this is the set of solutions we have from here. Then let's quickly see from the second equation. 2, we have 6xy equals to 5. Now let's use this first, you know, solution to see from here. We check and then we have 6 multiplied by 1 over 3 multiplied by 5 over 2. Is this equals to 5 from here? Of course, when we see, you know, we can equally say this is 3a1, 3a2 also. 2 year 1, 2 year cancel out. So we are left with 5 year. And then which is of course equals to 5. This confirms this particular solution. And uh, very quickly we can also check the other one to confirm. From here we have x as we have 6 times 5 over 3. Then times 1 over 2 is equals to 5 from here. Then we have it the same way. 3 cancel to also to cancel each other and then uh, we are still there with 5 which is equals to 5 of course here yeah, it satisfies the given problem thank you for watching don't forget these steps subscribe for more exciting videos also turn the notification bell on and uh, share this video see you next class and bye for now